on today's video, we are going to be decorating a two-tiered bookcase and the top of the bookcase, which also happens to be on top of a cabinet. The bookcase is from Kirkland from many, many years back. Do not mind the picture. You will not see it once everything is filled in. And here to the left is the placemats we're using. We're using two. And then the table runner on the right will be underneath the bookcase. I think the colors coordinate very well together. Here we've got a placemat on the left on the top shelf and a placemat on the right on the bottom shelf. Here's another just shot of the table runner again, so we can see the many different colors that we will be picking up later. Here on the bottom shelf, I've got two square block leaf prints. They're made out of wood. They came from, I believe, Bed Bath & Beyond many, many years back. And on the top shelf, we have, of course, a copper embossed tray and as well a two-tiered wooden tray that we will be putting a number of items in. Here you see we have a box. I am using some copper as the theme pretty much for this bookshelf. So we've got a copper owl Moscow mule mug and then some other items on the trays. Here we have a copper pitcher and a pumpkin. We've also got an acorn lidded jar as well as some other accents. We're trying to pick up the many different colors from the table runner. So here's an overall look for the top shelf. And here on the bottom to the right, we've also got a wooden mushroom. We've also got an, another acorn little jar, another copper, like a little box, an owl, a leaf. We're trying to pick up many different colors that were in the table runner. And then now here on the right, we have a black lantern. And now here is the final look. Now some things might could move around before the final final look, but for the most part everything is staying in place. Here on the top of the book case we have a copper leaf picture and then we also have a lantern. Now we filled in with a copper two-tier tray, some acorn mugs, another copper, I believe that's like a little lidded container. Now we've added a little bit more to it. Here again, it's going to be the overall look. This is not minimalist in any way. It is very, very full. But I like to create a vignette. Now underneath the bookcase, I've added a stack of plates that have different leaves on them, as well as an owl mustard color platter to pick up it so it's not completely empty. Mm -hmm. 